So what are the most important sales skills you need to have right now? Right? First one is everything that has to do with personal brand. And that's, that's a trend that you've been seeing over the last years and it's actually getting bigger, bigger and better. Meaning personal brand, you need to build your own brand on social media where you actually share, show your expertise. There's a lot of techniques. I've written a whole book around it called Nobody Knows How to Do All of That. But just remember, you need to be working on your own brand. In, in one way, it's a good way to find other work and people find you interesting, of course, for that. And it's the best CV you can have. And on the other hand, you will be able to sell way more. Now, how do you build that personal brand? Well, it fits exactly together with actually another technique, which is called value-based selling. You have to share value. And what you share is you have to educate and you have to inspire. And, and if you only gear your machine and everything you say on selling, selling, sales, 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 you will fail horribly. That's a technique of about 10 years, 20 years ago. And they still teach that. And when you watch the movies, but actually it's no longer working. And you know, but yet you can't resist to do that because that's how you think things should be done. Well, it's complete, utter BS. Don't do that. You share your passion. You share what you know. You teach them how to do certain things. And then, of course, one of the things that now is very easily, if you just think about a Facebook or an Instagram, I don't know if you realize, but you as a person, if you pay 500 euros, or $500, it doesn't matter, you can reach a lot, a lot of people. So you see me thinking, personal brands, Facebook, Instagram, right? It all kind of fits together, true. But what I want you to do is I want you to really think in scale. So you have to find a way to whatever you do to put it on true scale. That means the way to do it is to start using software tools for that. There are many, depending on social platforms, whatever you're talking, you could automate uh, some of the processes you're doing. So what I would recommend is I would first look into social. For instance, if you look at LinkedIn, which is a classic B2B thought leadership at the moment to scale your personal brand, you can, of course, start posting videos. And there is some software there that you can use to add connections and all of that. Two, you got to automate more and more. And three, there are some other tools that can actually find you phone numbers and all of that. Just start thinking like if I had to scale this on myself, I basically need two, three people. How can I replace them with software tools? Works really well. There's a lot of stuff to be found. And that's really where I see the difference between, let's call it more traditional sales, more conservative style and more of the new approach where people are taking scale. Of course, the balance between quality and quantity needs to be there, but never ever use the excuse of not being able to do the quantity because it needs to be quality. I do not buy it. You need both. By the way, we are all training on being better, but you also need to train on being faster. Last but not least, how to get through to somebody, it is the only way is by hyper-personalization. Meaning you have to find things that they are interested in and they have to stand out of the mass. So I more and more spend more time upfront writing something or doing something so I can reach somebody. Good example, a personalized video. It takes me 30 sec seconds. Hi, I'm Michael. I send them a picture of myself, short video. I show their websites. Things like that work really well. A lot of salespeople, they're nervous about it. And it's gonna, it's gonna take me a lot of time. Yeah, but the more time you spend upfront, the better the hit ratio is. So you need to find a way to do this, right? Those four tips, they will work great at any given time. And I think it's the base to becoming a better salesperson. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel because a lot more on that channel explaining all of this, especially this automation in detail.